Palawan is known as the green jewel of the Philippines. Here the biodiversity is richer than anywhere else in the country. The Filipinos call it their last unexplored paradise. In this edition of Philippine Life, we'll discover the treasures of Palawan, among them a mystical underground river. Our trip starts at the busy gateway to this unique island, Puerto Princesa, known as the city in the forest. The island is 450 kilometers long and borders the South China Sea in the northwest and the Sulu Sea in the southeast. Over half of Palawan's surface is still covered by ancient forests. It was mostly spared the devastation wreaked by Typhoon Yolanda last November. One of the island's treasures is the Puerto Princesa Subterranean River National Park. There are mangroves as far as the eye can see. This is Lady Mangrove, who's composed a song dedicated to the forests and its visitors. Ida Mayano has lived here for many years and puts her heart and soul into protecting the mangroves. These intertidal forests are among the most productive and complex ecosystems on Earth. Without mangroves, no balanced ecosystem. Animals, mangrove, people all around. It's balanced like that. Animal life need mangrove for uh, shelter, of course. This is a sanctuary of wildlife. And the food of animals are here. The dense foliage is home to a variety of exotic species. One of the most intriguing is the gold-ringed cat snake. It's known as the master of the mangroves. By day it sleeps, but in the night it wakes and hunts for prey. The yellow striped snake it is mostly found to the uh, river banks. Uh, that is snake is uh, stay here, will stay here because it will eat small fish. A boat ride away lies a place full of history carved out by nature, the world's longest navigable underground river. It's a UNESCO World Heritage Site and now one of the new seven wonders of nature. Over 8.2 kilometers long, the breathtaking river winds its way through a fascinating cave system and flows directly into the South China Sea. 23 million years ago, this unique limestone cast mountain landscape was formed and includes rock formations and stalactite pillars. A variety of species live here. Very common are bats and uh, sweet pledge, these birds. But in this cathedral, just right behind us, we found some, some creepy crawling creature, a big spider. It's tarantula. And we've seen snakes and some scorpions. The ceilings of the caves are teeming with life. Around 40,000 bats live in perfect harmony with thousands of so-called salanganas. Amazingly, these swallows have adapted to life in the dark. This is unique in the bird kingdom. They use some um, echolocation, like the whales, to, to reach uh, their nest. Those uh, sounds that they make, the waves bounces, and then they find their way to their destination inside and outside the cave. Life inside the caves dates back millions of years. Three years ago, Italian scientists made a stunning discovery. On the limestone wall, they found the fossil of a sea cow, which is estimated to be 20 million years old. The underground river is a place full of imagination and mystery. Um, going inside the underground river is like going into another world, another dimension, which uh, you never experienced before. And then coming out, it's like going back to your own world, which is the reality. 